This video shows how to move data with a data transfer task in Informatica Cloud Data Integration. A data transfer task allows you to easily transfer data using an intuitive wizard. In just a few steps, you can transfer data from a source to a target cloud data warehouse. We will create a data transfer task to transfer data from Salesforce to Snowflake. We'll also show you how to run the task and monitor its progress. After you log in, select Data Integration. Now, let's create a data transfer task. A data transfer task is simple to configure. We'll name the task and save it in the default location. Then we'll select the runtime environment that contains the secure agent to run the task. Next, we'll move to the source page to configure our source object. Data transfer tasks support a variety of connections to access your data. We'll select our Salesforce connection and account object. After you select an object, the data preview area lets you preview the data. We want to only pass active accounts to the target. So let's filter the source data by the active C field and set the condition to yes. You can augment your source with data from a second source. In this demo, we're not going to use a second source though. Now we'll configure our target object. Let's select our Snowflake connection and create a new target called account active only. Data transfer tasks allow you to use a variety of task operations, including update, upsert, and delete. Let's use the insert operation for this task. Next, we need to configure the field mappings. On the field mappings page, you can map source fields to target fields. You can manually drag source fields and then map them to the target, or you can use AutoMap to automatically link fields with the same or similar names. Because we are creating a new target at runtime, data integration automatically maps the source fields to target fields. You can configure a data transfer task to run on a schedule, or you can run the task manually. We'll run this task manually. But before we run the task, let's make sure that it's valid. The validation panel displays any errors. Now let's save and run the task. Once we start the task, we can monitor the task's progress on the My Jobs page. The My Jobs page shows the status of jobs that you've run. When the task completes, we can click the task's name to open the task's details. If there are any errors in the task, you can download the session log to troubleshoot the errors. In this video, we used a data transfer task to transfer filtered data from Salesforce to Snowflake Cloud Data Warehouse.